You're watching ROM. Now hop aboard Dominic Diamond's chopper for a final flight out to the games rig to meet the all new Games Master. This is offshore holiday resort where campers need only pack a joystick. So let's go over to Games Master for the first one. Greetings and welcome to the games rig. Now, we are experiencing some technical problems on the resort today, so apologies if I seem a little out of sorts. The salty seawater plays havoc with my delicate equipment, but rest assured I'll have it all repaired by the end of the show. So, let us begin with my first challenge for the evening. Teamwork makes the dream work. So, what better way to celebrate my latest corporate partnership than to watch the following VT package? I appreciate that may not satisfy the dangerous challenge-based entertainments that Channel 4 prefer, but I have a feeling you just might all be interested in the following announcement. Bye for now. 31 years ago, a little TV series debuted on Channel 4 which defined groundbreaking video game TV and rightly ripped a Jeroboam of ridicule out of a burgeoning games industry right for the pish-taking. Across seven series and 126 episodes, hundreds of ordinary punters, super cool kids, unwitting parents, confused celebrities and some hairy guy called Kirk fought for TV's most iconic prize, the Games Master Golden Joystick. A treasured trophy exclusive to games playing champions and eBay winners, it's no exaggeration to say that over the course of the show, this particular trophy caused more tempers, tears and decades-long feuds than any other item in human history. Well, that's all about to change, thanks to a special new partnership with the show that for once has nothing to do with burgers or evil multinational technology conglomerates wanting you to stick stupid stuff on your head, pretending it makes gaming cooler. Special Effect is an organisation that redefines the phrase my cap is doff to thee. They've been transforming the lives of people with physical challenges across the world for over 15 years, helping people access and enjoy video games. Its mission to maximise fun and quality of life has enabled people to control video games through bespoke control setups and the ability to communicate through specialist eye control software. Benefiting thousands of people individually, it's also led to a unique worldwide collaboration with hardware and software developers. One such gamer to benefit from a customised gaming setup is Aaron. Games are a big part of my life. With my disability, it was one of the only things I could do for enjoyment. So gaming has really opened up that door for me and it helps connect you to other people in this world. Seen here, founder, CEO and top bloke Mr McDonagan MBE has described special effect as a catalyst for change to increase support for disabled people, parents, carers and professionals. By all working together, a gaming world can be created where everyone can join in. Yes. It's enough to bring a lump to even our <laughs> jaded, aged, floppy, wattled throat. <laughs> So, being the good souls we are, we thought, what better way to celebrate our 31st anniversary than with this? Yes, the Games Master Time Special Effect joystick is the latest and greatest cash-making enterprise to bear our name and all in aid of raising money. 100% of it, actually, for our aforementioned friends. This exclusive remastered edition of TV's Greatest Prize is a faithful replica of the very same item we slapped with gold paint and slung into a cheap Perspex box all those years ago. Not for us, the tawdry temptations of holidays, houses and millions of pounds found on other TV shows. Limited to a numbered run of only 15, each joystick personally hand-polished by me with a minimum 10 millilitres of spit used on each, is enshrined in an all-new, vastly more expensive, etched display case. So, two collectors of 90s TV tat who have waited patiently to fill the gap between your bullseye tankard and your you bet trophy, head to readonlymemory.vg for full details of how to buy. But do not dilly or dally, as these are sure to sell out quicker than a resurrected 90s TV franchise. 
And with that excitement threatening to burst the blood vessels, let's see if the Games Master can help everyone to cheat like the losers they are in the consultation zone. Hello, Games Master. Hello, and welcome to my consultation chamber. What have you got to ask me? I keep dying on Captain Dynamo. Is any way you can help me? OK, let's figure this out. Play the game and press A, B, A, B, left, right, left, right. Now, not only will you be able to skip levels with the incredible confidence of a man with dynamic seniority, you'll also have infinite lives. Great, thanks. Oh, wait, actually, I think I might have confused that with Turtles in Time. Thinking about that, yes, that, that is what I've done. Sorry. In which case, I'm afraid I can't stop you dying. But that's life. Or, as the French say, that's life. I think I stole that joke. Hello, Gamesmaster. Hello! On Mickey Mouse on the SNES, I keep dying. Can you give me any tips to make it easier? Yes, I know this one. Guide your big-eared plumber friend through the third level of World One until you come across a white block. Duck for five seconds until you fall into some bushes. Then run to the end of the level where you'll be whisked away to meet a small, mushroom-headed person in red pants. They'll offer you a toot on their whistle. Kindly accept as it's too good an offer to refuse. Hang on a second, that sounds filthy. I didn't write this script. Thanks a lot. OK, who's last for the evening? Hello, Games Master. On Double Dragon on the Master System, is there a way of getting infinite lives? Actually, to be honest with you, I don't know. But you clearly love games, and I like the cut of your jib. So instead, I'm going to offer you some advice. In times of gaming peril, it's okay to fail. Stand tall in the face of adversity, and stay true to your character. For you already carry yourself with the spirit of a true games master. Albeit one with a penchant for smutty double entendres. Thank you, games master. Right, that's enough gaming titbits for this week. And also, I'm beginning to suspect that some of this script I've been given is filthy. And now it's time for me to don my smoking jacket and have a refreshing cup of chamomile. So I'll see you again in seven days. Good night. And there'll be more from the Games Master at the same time next week. Coming up next on ROM, the latest news headlines with Toby Anstis. Take care and support Special Effect. I love you. Bye! Pants!